Voting, along with other formal political activities, is important because voting is the bedrock of what a democracy should be. More importantly, it directly affects public policy at the local and national level. Unfortunately, history has shown us time and time again how voting rights across this country have been challenged, specifically affecting communities of color. Voter suppression also restricts states from receiving the funding needed to support adequate health care, education, housing, and much more. That is why we cannot talk about social justice without addressing the importance of voting. Being able to cast one's ballot should be the easiest way for individuals to participate in their local and national political processes. I became involved with voting and other civic engagement activities through community service I started in 2013. By volunteering for local organizations, I began to see the gaps in our political system. On an individual level, I wasn't sure how I would be able to combat such large social issues. However, when I got to KU in 2018, I found a variety of activities and resources that connected me to people who shared these common concerns and goals. Overall, through volunteering in my community and attending extracurricular events at KU, I was able to become more civically engaged and informed. You can register to vote at your home address, wherever you are from, or you can register at your KU address. The voter registration deadline in Kansas is 21 days prior to the election day. So if you don't get registered to vote before that deadline, you won't be able to participate in that election. I really encourage everyone, if you're interested in registering to vote in Kansas and participating in our elections, to visit ksvotes.org to get registered in less than five minutes. Or if you want to register out of state, wherever you're from, you can visit rockthevote.org as well. The last thing I'll say related to education around voting and something of why I believe it's so important is that we should all be creating a voting action plan. Where are you going to register to vote? Are you going to register at home or are you going to register at KU or at your university? You have that choice as a college student. The second is what is on your ballot? Are what's your take on the candidates or the questions that are there? This is going to take some research, but it's really important that you make an informed decision and that you can help inform other people in your network. And the third is how are you going to vote? Are you gonna vote early in person or by advanced voting in mail or in person the day of election day? Those are important choices to be deciding earlier on. And then after you've figured out every step in the voting process, help other people disperse this information because that's why I think this social change wheel part of voting and formal political activities is so important because it's the information we gain and then dispersing that information to other people in our community that need it because that's how we increase our collective power.